If you are visiting our channel for the first time, please subscribe first to get the latest updates. In our previous lectures, we have seen what is meant by third and fourth proportional and how you can find the third and fourth proportional if three or four quantities are given. Today we will see what is meant by mean proportion. If in this case, if three quantities are given, now keep this in mind that in case of third proportional, three quantities are uh, uh, were required. In case of fourth proportional, four quantities were required and in case of mean proportional, again, it is applicable on three quantities. So if three quantities are related as, let's say these, uh, these three quantities are A, B and C, then A ratio B proportion B ratio C. In this case, this B is the mean proportion. So you can say that B is called mean proportion to A and C. Now let's see how you can find the mean proportional if you are given with the two quantities and how you can find the third one by using its standard form. And what is the standard form? The standard form is this one. Okay. So the example is you have to find the mean proportional of 20 and 45. So in order to find the mean proportional, you have to first write it in its standard form. That is A ratio B proportion B ratio C. Here A is 20 and C is 45. And what is unknown? Unknown is B. That is the mean proportion. So in order to find this, what we have to do? We have to again apply the rule that is product of means is equal to product of extremes. So we can write it as 20 multiplied by 45 is equal to B multiplied by B. That means B square is equal to 900. And if we take the square root on both sides, then it will become B is equal to plus minus 30. So the value of B comes out plus minus 30. So this is how you can find the mean proportional by, use, by first writing it in its standard form and then solving it for just like the just like you solve the, uh, the questions in, uh, as in the proportion. Let's have one more example. Example number two is find mean proportional of 20x cubed by 5 and 5x7y. Let's see how you can do that. So I'll just write first the standard form A ratio B ratio B ratio C where A is 20x cubed by 5 and B is unknown and C is 5x7y. Okay, then again apply the method that is product of means is equal to product of extremes. Here the product of means are B into B and extremes are 20x cubed by 5 into 5x7y. So B square is equal to 20x cubed by 5 dot 5x7y and it will become B square is equal to 100 x 10 y 6 and b square we are taking square root on both sides what we will get we get under root 100 can be written as 10 square x raised to power 10 can be written as 5 square and y 6 can be written as like this so uh, cancelling square with the under root what we will get is b is equals to 10 dot x 5 dot y cube so b is 10 x 5 y cube this is the mean proportional of 20 x cube by 5 and 5 x 7 y so this is how you can find the mean proportional um, by uh, just first writing in the standard form and then solving it just like in case of proportions thank you thank you for watching if you like this video please don't forget to subscribe our channel math.com for more updates thank you